Hey everyone, so I was about to clean Rosie and Daisy's cage and I decided I'd just film it because why not? So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna change up a few things. I have this wooden barrel thing to hang up in the cage somewhere. I'm not quite sure where I'm gonna put it yet. And then also, I don't know, just the usual cleaning is what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm in my PJ pants, don't, don't judge me. Cleaning has got to be done. So this cage cleaning is overdue. The cage stinks a little. Just a little of pee. Uh, I desperately need to do it. So just keep watching. So here's the bottom of the cage. Full of poop. And then, yeah. So I need to take this bedding out. Replace it. Wipe the bottoms, whatever. And then the top part is simple, there's nothing really I need to do here. I'm gonna take the hammocks out and do something and then put that wooden barrel in somewhere. I don't know, we'll see what happens. Chinchillas poop so much, it's unbelievable the amount that they poo. And if you don't clean often, it just really gets backed up and it's insane. You won't believe how much these little rascals poo. I put this block of this little tile here just for when the water bottle does drip and then it can drip onto the tile and not onto the fleece and then into the newspaper and whatnot. So that is the bottom half of the cage done. That's basically the cleaning for this cage I guess. Um, the top half doesn't really require cleaning but I am going to go up there and show you guys some stuff. So there it is, a nice clean chinchilla cage. All I need to do is put new food in, fresh water, and then put their hay in. And that'll be it for today. So yeah, this didn't take like that much effort, I guess. But you do have to do it twice a week because as you saw, it got disgustingly dirty and smelly. So, you know, it takes time and if this just is too much for you or you just found it boring then I don't know if you can even handle chinchillas and if you thought that a lot of poo was disgusting then you don't even know what a lot of poo is because I had actually vacuumed around the cage before I started filming uh, yeah you're glad I did because the amount of poo around a chinchilla's cage is insane. They have these poo gods, but it does nothing. It truly does nothing. The amount of poo these girls just fling when they are running is insane. So chinchillas are an animal that you really have to be comfortable with poo to own because otherwise it's insane.
you guys have it. That was me cleaning the chinchillas cage, Rosie and Daisy. It was kind of bad and stinky and really full of poo. But I wasn't going to like half clean it and then be like, oh, I'm starting only now clean my cage. Like I wasn't going to do half of it and then show you what half a dirty cage looked like. I showed you the full dirty cage. Like I said, I actually did vacuum the floor at least. So I didn't scare you too much. But chinchillas are really messy. They poo, I swear, like a thousand times a day. And the poo really adds up. So that's just the honest truth of what chinchilla ownership is. I hope you enjoyed seeing what cleaning a chinchilla cage is really like and enjoyed seeing them occasionally. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!